Honestly, the food scene in Denver is not that great, but I always make sure to come back to Saigon Bowl. I've been coming here since I was a kid. People don't believe me when I say the Vietnamese food scene is really good here in Denver, but it is. So you cook the rice paper, then you take some lettuce. I like to put all my herbs in there, some mint, some Thai basil. And normally I put in cilantro, but I don't see cilantro on the plate. Some pickled radish and carrots, some bean sprouts. And then on this platter, there's beef, soft shell crab, egg rolls, fried shrimp paste, shrimp. I'm gonna go with pork. And then they give you the sauce. So I like to put the noodles in nok mam, and then into the spring roll. And then you wrap it like a burrito. And then you have yourself a beautiful spring roll. Mm. It's so fragrant with all the herbs. So good. Soft shell crab. And I absolutely love Vietnamese egg rolls. The healthy serving of milk mom. Oh my god. This is Bonnie Bray ice cream, which is super famous and the line can sometimes go all the way around the block. I cannot believe the child's double is this big. This is crazy. <laughs> Twix flavor. Finally got to the rocky road. I'm just a very crunchy waffle <laughs> cone. I also went to Monarch Casino to try their brunch buffet. It was $58.99 per person, which exceeds the price of my favorite buffet in Las Vegas, the Wicked Spoon. They had a decent assortment of Italian, seafood, Mexican, Asian, breakfast foods, salad bar, and prime rib and ham. So to start, I got prime ribs, some cheese, bacon, eggs, mushroom, and some actually some pesto salmon over here. So you're allowed to get one lobster and one crab and they give you uh, vouchers at the front. Second plate, I got some omelet, biscuits and gravy, corned beef hash, and cheese blends. For my third plate, I got more prime ribs, some salad, pineapple, mashed potatoes, and one shrimp. So this plate, I got a lobster and I got some crab. My mom didn't want her, so I'm eating hers. Oh, so satisfying. Oh, so satisfying. <laughs> got a carrot cake and a macaron. Pecan so bar, apple cobbler, bread pudding, cinnamon swirl cake. I feel like the buffet is a little pricey for what it is, but two crab and one lobster plus the prime rib and other stuff, it was all pretty good. Not the best I've had, there are better buffets in Vegas, but pretty good. We went to Hoon's Palace, which is a Chinese restaurant I've been going to since I was a kid. My favorite is the Hunan beef, and we also get orange prawns, Mongolian beef, salt and pepper pork, house cha fun, and yushang chie zi, which is garlic eggplant. This Hunan beef is just so good. Sweet, salty, slightly spicy. Amazing. If there's one place I always make sure to visit at least once on my trips back, it's Duffy Roll Cafe. Their flaky, crispy cinnamon rolls are so unique and delicious. The pecan crunch one is still warm. Flaky goodness. Look at all those layers. Ridiculous. This orange one has been my favorite for years. Oh. I've eaten like three rolls already. <laughs> as far as brunch spots go, this is a newer spot I hadn't heard of, but I got the green chili omelet, corned beef hash benedict, blueberry pancakes, candy, bacon, and fresh cinnamon donuts. Green chili is something very specific to Colorado. Mm. I always love candied bacon, so the candied bacon was delicious, as were these fresh, hot cinnamon donuts. So good. Wow. Highly recommend. These are good. This is award-winning corned beef hash. I'm not normally a fan of corned beef hash, but this one was incredible. Ah, so good. These pancakes are honestly just like... They're a little soggy. There's too much fruit syrup on it. So it's just been sitting in this fruit syrup and it's kind of soggy. 